Hey, welcome to the official Windows 8 channel and today we are talking about the mail app. Um, yes, you're probably saying, well, you already did a little talk about the mail app. Well, I will do a new video for one simple reason. A um, big update of the core apps happened on uh, the end of May somewhere, like May 31st. Um, there was an update. So if you haven't checked your Microsoft uh, Store updates, I would suggest that you go and check out if you uh, have for download the core apps of your computer, which is Mail, Messaging, Calendar, and People. Uh, these are what we call the core apps, the ones that are integrated into Windows 8 um, by default and um, probably what is considered the most important apps on Windows 8. What does your Windows 8 update uh, of these apps bring is interesting. Now you have junk mail filtering. There was no filtering of junk mail before, unfortunately. And now everything is there. If you right click on any messages in your mail account, now you have easy options at the bottom for um, of course on the left side syncing your mail folder options so you can make folders and put all that information into different folders and categories uh, pin to start if you want select all is there so if you wanna select all the messages at once for example for uh, delete an example now on the right side what's interesting is now that you have an easy print button which is right here on the uh, bottom on the right side icons you can flag a message now you can also junk mail so you click junk and it's going to uh, actually add it to a junk mail filter that was not available before the update you can move your message easily to any folders for example and of course you can mark unread if you uh, clicked the message for example and say oh I don't want to check it right away but I want to quick you know have a quick and easy way to see it as a new mail uh, when I uh, start over and look at my mail well you can mark unread that's going to bring you uh, kind of a new message type um, so basically all these new options are available now so uh, one of the very important was junk mail we do receive junk mail from time to time um, if you have good filters and a good email account usually we don't receive a lot but we do receive junk mail it is part of receiving mail uh, email but you shouldn't receive you know thousands of them if you do receive thousands of junk mail you have a problem but we you know I get maybe two or three junk mails that's filtered through um, every week and having the junk mail option now is pretty cool so um, I suggest that you uh, actually use that junk so if you have a junk mail for example all you have to do is just click junk and it is flagged as junk mail right away and that email address will be simply removed from uh, the possibility of receiving so be careful because if you junk mailed something uh, that could be a problem so um, cool new options in the mail app on this update uh, I think they're doing a good job in uh, improving all of these uh, apps um, the mail app was kind of deficient you know at first when they started um, the mail app was not that useful but now with this second major update of the mail app I think it is getting to a point where it is useful and interesting so um, if you don't see the information that I just told you if you can't see these new options at the bottom of your mail app it means that your app is not updated so go to the Microsoft Store and get the update for your core apps it's going to be available it's there for the past uh, 10 days or so 
So, um, and this is, we're June 11, 2013 right now, and this has been available for more than 10 days. Um, so go and get these if you don't have that information. If you don't see any of the options that I've just shown you, it means that your uh, mail app is not updated. So go and get the update on the Microsoft Store. So thanks for watching. Hope you enjoy our videos. And uh, if you have any comments, questions, or maybe a request for some um, Windows 8 feature you'd like us to talk about, let us know. Um, one thing also, if you have that new Windows 8 machine and want to learn more, I think you should subscribe to our channel. Keeps you up to date with the news and also the features of Windows 8. And um, if you uh, have that Windows 8 machine, take a look at our videos. Lots and lots of videos showing you how to do all sorts of uh, things on Windows 8, how to use it and how to uh, really master Windows 8. Um, slowly but surely it is a big jump from an old operating system so uh, you know most people that get into Windows 8 say oh, wow uh, I'm lost I don't know what to do from here so uh, our videos are here to help you um, as best as I can of course and uh, hope you enjoy them thanks for watching hope you come back to the official Windows 8 channel bye bye